what uh what were the popular posts this week Ooh, yeah there were a lot um some that got like the most engagement was, was of course Dorita's um post about how she was going to set aside the fear and she mentioned about how you know Michael asked about entering courtship and she said yes hey listen and that was a breakthrough like that's that's a win for everybody you know it's yes. like yes. when a diamond uh overcomes a hurdle like that like doc said you know by the time you see somebody that has done an assignment so much work went on before so it's like you're seeing someone who was a CEO of CEOs. Y'all hear that? She CEO, y'all. CEO. She is. She's mm -hmm. boss diamond. You know, like I said, I've just got <laughs> right. Smurfs. Right. You know, She's running shit. Yeah. Right. So in my head, I got, you know, y'all are different names for diamond. So she's, Dorita's like boss diamond for real. Really and it's is. like to Mama see. Mama diamond. Mm -hmm. Yes, and to see her just in the face of fear, because she's never saying that, you know, all right, I, I'm doing this, let's do this, this is it. No, it's like, that's what courage is, right? It's like, in the face of fear, I have made a choice. I choose to, to literally step over this into that on purpose, and I'm, I'm going to say Yes, and that is what she's doing, you know. And so, her sharing that and then letting us in on that is just um, that's a win for everybody. Yes, and it's she like just, she just said in her that that's a victory truth. for the whole mind. Yes, you know. So she just said she was scared yeah. as hell too. You know what, Dorita? Though I'm proud of you, honey. I mean, that was just inspirational. You know, the fact that you mm -hmm. faced the fear that, that you even told us, because you could have dealt with, as, as a CEO, you could have dealt with this in private, mm -hmm. did the gnashing of the teeth, as Doc say, and then came to the realization that, okay, I'm going to give you a chance <laughs> all on your own. But you put yourself out here, and we just killing it this, this week, CEOs. I'm sorry. I just got to brag about y'all this week. Um, you, you put yourself out here, and you just, you did it. And I'm proud of you. And it's inspirational, and I love it. You know, because Michael was like, we doing this or not, you know? And you like, hey, I'm with it. And I love it. I love you guys' love story. It's beautiful. Yeah. It and is. I think the, the beautiful thing about the diamond mind and is we get to see these stories unfold. Yes. You know, we get to go. To me, it's all about the journey. Um, mm -hmm. And I think it's a very uh, beautiful thing for people to see every step of your journey, to see when it was mm -hmm. difficult, to see the tears to see the laughter, to see the overcoming, to see the two steps forward and the three steps back. I Amen. think all of that is a part of it. And I think it, everybody feels like they have a buy-in, you know, to your success yeah. and wanting to see you get there. Yeah. So for those of us who have seen what Dorita has come through, cause he, you know, some of us know about Jimmy, you know, and from the, the group coaching and we know how that happened. And, and how disappointing um, that was. And- Oh, that's so Dorita. Yeah, and, and so shortly thereafter, and when I tell you shortly, and I know of two people it happened that way for. Um, the other one was Lexi. Right after the door closed on one situation, immediately, like not long after that, something else happened, something way better. Wow. Um, and, and I, you know, Dorita was talking about how you just, you don't know when it's going to happen when you least expect it. Okay. It just comes out of nowhere. And this whole idea of getting ready for it, there's a certain level of getting ready. Yeah. Dorita said in 24 hours, um, there's a certain yeah. level of getting ready, but then are, you know, are you ever fully ready? Because, and I'd like to point out that Dorita has been doing the work. She like has. she uses yeah. the group coaching 
but she uses the uh, um she uses what's happening in the group i know for a fact that that second interview with chris also um played a part in that because after we did that interview me dorita and chris all talked together and she shared about you know some of the fears that she had and how she was gonna go for it you know what i mean like after hearing you know like his story so it's like you know how can you maximize what's happening in in your own coaching or in your own or in the group if that's what you have access to right now how, how can i use all of these resources to impact me and she really inspires me in that way because i'll admit and i'll talk more about this later that um as an intellectual sometimes i receive a lot of information but it's not quite penetrating yet and dorita has even pointed this out to me so like doc will say something i'll read something i'll watch somebody's videos and i'm like mm -hmm, yeah that makes sense i i get it i get it but then it's not showing up in the in my decision making and in my choices you know so to see somebody actually doing that, it's like, man, it's something to aspire to. So in addition to it being a beautiful love story, it's like, wow. So this is what can happen when you actually are maximizing your experience, the whole diamond experience across the way, you know, from the videos to the coaching to what's happening in these groups. What do you add something um when dorita was doing her one of her videos um i made a comment about love you know and she, i was feeling frustrated that week and she said you know Keith, i thought that way too and i think i might have made some comment to the extent that you feel like it happens to everybody else but not you you know because mm. mike like a genuine authentic guy and dorita said you know mm -hmm. i thought that too keisha but it happens when you least expect it and it really does. I know that sounds like to some of us something completely far fetched. And I like what Dr. said about Lexi and Dorita, how one door closed and something better came along. I always felt bad because me being a serial monographer, I felt bad. I, that's like a red flag to me, somebody coming right behind something else. But just what Doc said and get Dorita giving me that advice, it blessed me in this moment to want to go forward fearless. You know, but it really does happen like that, ladies. It really, really does. You know, and like you said, Dorita's doing the work, you know, even with Lexi, she did the work within herself so she could attract this type of man. And a lot of times, Diamonds, as you grow, you're shining from the inside out and you may not even can see it because you're still feeling confused and conflicted. And I don't know what I'm doing. This feels weird. But other people can see your glow. They can see it. And I think Michael saw that and I believe in energy. And I think when they connected online, he felt that and he saw that in her. And even though she was afraid, he saw something there that was valuable that he didn't want to let go. And that's what I love. And I just, I love how he left her and he won't let go. You know, because real men do real things. They hold on tight. And he ain't leaving the crack in the door for another man to walk up in there. He locked God, that down no. quick. Come on. No. Okay. No, no. Um, and, and I always say that, you know, it, when when the unicorn shows up, you know, mm. hey, hey, unicorns are, <laughs> you know, unicorns are real. Okay, you see that unicorn? It's it's real. Um, mm -hmm. 